Hey guys, back with another video. Um, this is actually a retake of one that I already took and I decided I don't like how it turned out, so I decided to do it again. Um, I was downstairs going through some stuff that I wanted to get rid of in a soon-to-be garage sale and I came across this Uno Rummy Up um, game. It's sort of like Grummy Q, and I'm keeping the box for um, to cut up for chipboard. But anyway, when I opened the box, I saw these tiles, and they're like um, they're thin, but they're sort of like the dominoes, you know, with that kind of smooth backing and stuff. But you still got the Uno impress you know, the logo and pressed in this side. But, you know, the opposite side's nice and smooth and I thought maybe I can, you know, use my alcohol and inks to, you know, to play with that. So I did and I took one. This is how it turned out. You can sort of still see three if you, um, tilted a certain way, but otherwise it's not too bad. I do have to say that um, I did do the sides and stuff, but, you know, if you handle it a lot, like I've been doing, <laughs> you know, all day since I, you know, did this, it does rub off a little bit. You can see, you know, here and then, you know, at the ends, like, you know, I've touched it up, or, you know, you can... Like I said in my earlier video that I delete, you know, try not to use, um, you could put like, you know, scrap and paper and whatnot on there and, you know, seal it really well with some glossy accents, you know, just like you would use with the domino. So it came with a thing of a hundred tiles, you know, with the numbers and the draw fours and all that stuff. So I probably give some out of racks and some for me and I don't know what's the rest. So let's make a little quick share and see see it more come off. So you gotta be careful with the nails and hands and stuff. When you use the alcohol ink on on these because it is plastic. So, um, that's my little share, and, uh, thanks for watching.